Hey guys, welcome to the channel. I actually am on today because I have a collaboration with uh, Timu, or Timu. I do apologize if I'm saying it wrong. I've heard several different people say it different ways. So after a while, you don't know which way to say it. So I had, they came and decided or emailed me, uh, no kitty. Kitty is not, you did not come from the, the store. You get down. Um, came and asked to do a collab. Um, took me a minute or two to, to say yes because of everything going on. If you guys need to know what's going on in the update with me and my family, please go to the video before this and it tells you everything you need to know. But stay here and watch this because there's some good deals, okay? So, Team Mew Spring Sale. Guess what? It's on right now. Um, their products are up to 90% off. Not all, but, you know, you get discounts. Um... You can enjoy my 30% off discount code, which all this stuff will be linked down below. Um, let's see. Spring's in the air. So, Timu's biggest sale of the year is right now. I will be ordering again. Just to let you know, I will be ordering again. Um, shop till you drop. And that's pretty much what I kind of did here. Um, I will have four videos. Um, I will have probably two as like an opening um, or unboxing and, um, two, two, like we have some like Lego block people, um, to put together, see how hard they are to see if they're exactly like the Legos, um, products like that. If you are doing team you through like the computer and then you download their app, you can use my discount code. For New Year's is only though. Um, they have free shipping and returns through the U.S. Uh, let's see what else do I want to tell you. Why did I just do the Christmas theme song? It seemed like. Um, so yeah, so let's get into this haul. There is a little bit of stuff, but I wanted, I wanted to go different. I didn't do clothes yet or anything like that. But stuff for like Zach for Easter because Easter was coming. Stuff for the house. Just to get a variety of stuff to see how well things were. And I'm going to smack my dog, I think. Um, she is just being a, a poop head today. So if you hear her, I do apologize. Alright, so let's go ahead and get started. Everything I'm showing you that I know of it will be linked down below. Uh, prices are down below. Um, I did put it on the packaging so I will let you know if, you know, what the price is. Because some of this stuff I know is out of stock. Um, so I will do my best to tell you what is in stock and what is out of stock. We're going to go ahead and get started with some of the stickers that I had gotten. Um, again, I did have help with some of this stuff because Zachary loves stickers. So the first thing that I, I had picked up were cat and mouse stickers and it is yep look at tom and jerry stickers look at how cute these are you get 50 of them tom and jerry um like there's a whole bunch of different i went through some of them i did not really see any duplicates at all so you get 50 different stickers dollar 99 which is not bad Okay, so there's our first stickers. The second ones also has 50 in them for $1.99. They actually call these like cute raccoons. But my son seen it and that's not what he sees. If you guys have ever went to a zoo and seen it, they have red pandas. And these little boogers look like red pandas. So he considered these little red pandas, but they are considered on the website as little raccoons. But how cute, that one's not cute. Where's the cute one? Like this one, he's like, mom, that's a red panda. I'm like, no, it's not. But he swears they are, so. 
Um, these will go in, like I said, some of these will go in his Easter basket. Now these are all him. Uh, these are the weirdest <laughs> stickers I've ever seen. These are called like rainbow friends. Again, like I said, all this stuff is going to be linked down below. Um, at least the fir first couple of it. Look at these. These, I, 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 it's a game, some kind of game. I, I, um, yeah, I don't know. Okay. Mind you, I have an 11, almost 11 year old. That's <laughs> the weirdest thing ever. Let me find another one. There you go. Okay. So again, there are 50 of them. These, though, I think were $1.39. Um, so, which is still kind of cool as well. Because um, it doesn't break the bank. I'm trying to put these back in. All right, so that's the next thing. Up. The next thing up that we're going to do are a couple of the Lego looking dudes. They look exactly like Legos. And my problem is on the Lego thing is that my son doesn't want the whole set of Legos. He truly does it. He just wants the little dudes. And them little dudes, when you go on Amazon, Molly is my is my husky and she's being a pain in the butt. Stop being so mouthy. Thank you. So, as I said before, all he wants are the dudes. Just seriously, the dudes. And if I go online on any kind of other platform to buy them, they're anywhere from, I want to say $8.99 for one little dude. This is a big little dude, though. So, this is White Spider-Man or Carnage. I'm not for sure what he's called. Um, I just I just typed in Legos and a whole bunch of this stuff came out. This thing cost $2.28. So, he liked the white one. And then he liked Carnage. I think it's the red one. And Black Spider-Man. Again, $2.28. And as far as I know, these are still available. Um, the next two things I had are, they look like Star Wars Legos. Um, and I, well, actually I know, I think this is, this looks like, um, oh, what is it? Boba Fett? The thing? And a Stormtrooper. Now I tell you right now, these were 98 cents. 98 cents. And I was doing on other things for one four dollars. I don't want a hundred and thirty dollar Lego set that he doesn't use. We have several of them. So we got two different ones. I know there's more and you'll see in um, other future videos as well. Um, so there they are. The other thing that I picked up was a veggie slicing mold new house figured be something different that i don't have this was 89 cents but i will say this is sold out i did go check um i will be letting you know um how it if it was okay to use so this will be one of my videos with some of the um household items um, another thing of stickers, which I didn't realize, they were the people stickers um, for journaling, and that's what I'm going to use these for. These actually are mine. They are a dollar forty-nine, and I do believe these may be out of stock. See, these are the black and white ones, not for sure. But like I said, all this stuff on these will be linked down below. The next thing I have, and this cost a dollar seventy-nine. We have cats, and you guys know we have cats. And being that we're in a new home, they are um, kind of just bored out their mind because they used to be able to go outside and all that stuff. So, oh, well, as soon as I figure out how I am supposed to do this, 
So we got, I wanted to try this out and figure it out. It is an over the door cat toy. Um, so you can put it as long as you need um, and then connect it down here down the bottom. So we're gonna try this out with the kitties today. Um, I'm gonna put it in it and hope to goodness that the dogs do not decide to go run with it, which would be funny, but you know how that goes. So we're gonna leave that out and I'll tell you how that works for that. Couple craft things I did for you. I did for myself, cause I, I'd like to do some wax melts and then I did a goober thing and didn't order the other piece. But I'll show you what I ordered and then I will have to go buy the other part to help me. This thing is right here. And I just wanted something simple to do this cost. Me, this was 79 cents. This handle is plastic. So it is plastic. You screw this on. And then this is the tree one. Um, I've never used one. Um, I don't, I'm having right now, you can see that I am having a little bit of issue with screwing this on. But on for their defense, remember, I've been moving and my arms are kind of, okay, I got it on. It was snug. So it's snug. That's a good thing. You want it snug. Um, so I did pick the tree one up. But what do you think I forgot? Nope, got wax here. This is a wax, it's a sunflower set of wax melts. And this was $7.98, which I thought was pretty good for all of this. You get the little plastic thing they're in. I just thought it was really nice. So I have this, I have this. What did I forget? Exactly the thing that melts it. So my husband said, don't worry about it. We'll go get it so we can test this out. So I am going to put this in here. And these are down below if you are interested. Um, they do have other sets. Um, I just picked out the one I thought I would use the most of. Is kind of what I was going for. And to try it out. Because if I don't like it, then who knows, this may be gifted. We'll see. Alright, like I said before, um, Easter was coming. So, these were 98 cents. Again, another Star Wars dude. Like, we will be boxing or putting these together, I think, for one of the videos. And, go over from there. The other pack. This was awesome to find, I thought. These were among us characters. The little spaceship characters. I get... What was it? Eight in here? A whole pack. I'm not for sure. Let's open them. But it was four dollars and forty-eight cents, I believe. I ripped where the package was. But you get all of these little dudes. So we got two pack. We have two dudes in here. So you get two, four, six, eight. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. If I'm right, there's 16 little dudes in here. All came for that price. I can't make my own type thing looking like this for $4. Look how much you get for $4. Bear it back. Sorry, guys. I got a phone call. Way of uh, selling stuff, huh? So let's get started to, uh, let's move on and let's get kicking. Let's get kicking. All right. Um, I forgot to show you. This was another Lego. Like we actually, I bought Legos, um, stuff. So for Zach for Easter, like I said, so there's that one. And this was 89 cents. All right. Now these I know are out of stock and I do apologize. Um, 
They they were $249, but like I said, if you like these, and I believe it's in my link below, that we will you can submit to notify them. But these are black and white. These are vintage stickers. There's a hundred pieces. Look at this, like okay. The packaging. Oh man. Oh. They are fabulous. I wonder if I can get that. Nope, I gotta do something. Sorry guys, my eye is just killing me. Look at that. So they're they are like the see-through ones. Um they're they are so pretty. Like let's let's take a look out of some of these. Like the old look look. Gorgeous. See, that's fine. Here we go. Let me this one. Look how pretty that is. Now, let me see how well it is. I have a problem with my hands. Um, and I, I don't have any fingernails right now. I'm having a little issue, but if you have... Nope, I don't have any issues. So there you go. But it, it looks like this the white so there you have it I am not going to put them back in right now at all but there's like a little vellum envelope that you could use even afterwards you could use that you could cut that out and use that so in all honestly this is some good stuff yeah. um more vintage type thing. I'm gonna set this aside. Like I said, these last time I checked, it was one before I did the video, was um, $249 and they were sold out. Okay. Um, I only bought one die, and it's a window die. Um, it was $249. Or no, $2. 38 I do apologize this is what the cost of this says so I will be trying it out once I get my die cutting machine out like I said um, it actually is in storage like in the storage area um, we'll see how it how it goes see if I can get at least my little one um, to see how it cuts all right then we have I bought some stencils. This was a dollar sixteen, but look how cool this stencil is. Okay, that's in stock, I know. Then I decided to do magnets. I'm like, oh, I'll do magnets. I'll think of like the little magnets that if you want to put in a journal and you just don't want to do Velcro, do the little magnets. So I'm thinking, okay, so I picked the little ones, not realizing. I had 300 of these little boogers. Look at. One moment, please. Look at how small these little things are. Like, look how small. I'm trying to get it through my fingernail. I mean, it, it's so tiny. Like, can you see that? Like, can you see the line of how tiny these are? They'd be okay, right? For in a journal and I got 300 of these little boogers 300 be easy to play pick up sticks and it come in this little container 300 of these right for three dollars and 48 cents I don't know if that's good I don't know if that's bad but they're a three by one by 300 I think yeah three by one so it's like what a penny a piece i think i don't know my math isn't working <laughs> okay anyways. all right um let's see i think for this haul since we're we're on 20 minutes i think i'm going to do one more thing and then um we'll do the next haul um 
but I I ordered I don't I don't remember saying I wanted two of these for one but um, these are towels and they they're cute um, not quite for sure they're supposed to be cleaning towels they are 95% rayon and 5% um, spandex okay the thing that gets me about these is I I did look up I thing and there's a said they were heavy duty um, and you do get I believe 10 I got 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 yes I get 10 in a pack so I bought I got 20 all together but when you go to look at this um, and they were two ninety eight dollars for the pack. Which, again, not bad. But it says wash with Luke, uh, Luke Color. Hand wash on cold. Hand wash. Do not bleach. Remove promptly. Line dirt in the shape. Do not iron. Do not... Wire or twist, do not dry clean. Maybe I'm reading this wrong, so I'm going to let you see what this says. Now, the only question I have is this. When I do a towel, it says do not twist. Okay. When you put water in it, even wring out. So, if I'm not supposed to twist it, how are you supposed to use it? So, we're going to try it out anyways. And we're going to do everything I would do on any normal towel that I have. And I'm going to do it on a video. So, if something happens, you're going to know. Um, but I got two of these and I did do a different other towel thing. So, there you have it. This is... Part one of my TMU haul um, with the collab. So they did sponsor all this. They, I get the free, you know, to review the stuff. So um, stay tuned for part two of the opening, and hopefully we can get the rest of it in. But the all their description and everything would be down below on what is um, available right now. That same description will be on the second video as well. So I hope you guys go check it out and use my code if you're a new user. Um, I would say it's a plus for right now. Um, on the stuff is really quality. And well, let's see what a housewife can do to see if these actually hold up. So guys, until next time. And stay tuned for part two. Bye and keep crafting and bye for now.